Hello everybody, welcome to Monday Night Claw. I'm Jimmy Ventura and in the booth with me is Rick Schiavone. Hello. Hello Jim, great to be here after the epic Survivor Series. So now let's see exactly what the fallout is. Woo! Woo, yeah. <laughs> Woo indeed. <laughs> it's uh it should be wild. We're getting the we're getting the match we were denied. Well the match up we were denied due to 2K being uh, you know, on a par with Cyanide at coding games. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be getting that as the main event EAB versus Crusher that is going to be glorious isn't it yeah we uh, we didn't get EAB in the ring at all last night so yeah cannot wait <laughs> technically it could have gone all the way through and he still didn't get in the ring if his team won it <laughs> without him but, <laughs> yeah. uh, but yes it was very likely we should have had some EAB and we didn't so awesome man cannot wait for the main event yeah and now we've got not Volkvagor. He did lose his title. He seems to be in denial there <laughs> in the chat. <laughs> but he did lose he, his title he, to Chugs. And he didn't become the world champion because he, he had a shot last night and he couldn't get it done against uh, Johnny B. Good. Yeah, great defense from JBG. But who's going to take on Chug Almond Milk now? I guess he is. <laughs> I try not to speculate too much, but I want to, every time now, I'm going to ask Is it full pause? <laughs> Is it Fault Paws? He beat him a week ago. Will he order him to defend his title against him? Uh, let's see. Oh boy, it's the face of the JFW. <laughs> <laughs> oh baby. He's one of Fault Force's favorite people in the world. <laughs> There's one JFW superstar happier than Wanger. It's this guy, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I have seen CBT do their worst and he's still smiling all the way through it. <laughs> it does it takes a lot to ruffle the feathers of uh, <laughs> the fire I can't say that can I with uh, the fire wrestling kicker. <laughs> Just <laughs> Not seen it for a while. Can he become the Wendo champion? I'd love to have just go as Wendo champion. That'd be ace. Yeah. <laughs> I don't mean mask, uh, Fast Apache. This is his real face. <laughs> There's no tears in the world of just Joe. Just dangerously elevated levels of dopamine. <laughs> Yeah. It's true he makes he makes Rick Reckless look cool, calm and collected. Gonna <laughs> <laughs> you know, have to be optimistic though, isn't he? To win tonight. Yes. Yeah. Chuck, Chuck Manmo got an absolute tear. Dominant last night. The the match did not go long. Yeah, it's very true. Wonder if he'll be tired though. I mean, yeah, he shouldn't be that tired, should he? So, yeah, he's he's done it the way he had to, and and got it done quick. Otherwise, yeah, if he'd had a classic, if he'd had a brutal war last night, you'd be worried for him today. But uh, I think he'll be close to a hundred percent. What does Chubb look like, honestly? He actually looks better in the suit because you can't see his weird square shape body. <laughs> <laughs> We've all got our own sense of style. <laughs> I remember when he turned up uh, to the water bowl, the NAF tournament one year, and asked where the champagne was. <laughs> I've seen just Joe ask where the vodka was. He's a he's a vodka he's a vodka and water man. Is a it's just Joe. That's that's why I that's why I had it. It was recommended to me. Recommended. He's around my neck of the woods if he's Manchester. Yeah, yeah. He's uh, 
He's somewhere, it's not actually Manchester, but he's close to Manchester. Yeah. He is your neck of the woods, yeah. I tell you, he sounds like Carl Fogarty. He sounds like exactly like Carl Fogarty. Huh, huh. Um, he's from some. He's from some like small town, in like near a big one, in that neck of the woods. I can't remember. <laughs> maybe. Yeah, maybe Sean, he's Shawnee's best work. Yeah, maybe it is Burnley. Is that near you, Burnley? Not miles away. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, Chugs are going to do it again. <laughs> he wants it done in 42 seconds. Oh. I hope Joe is hungry because he's eating an awful lot of turnbuckle right now. I feel like Joe needed to get off to a good start in this one, Jim. That has not happened. No. Oh, no. The stall suplex already. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. This is a demolition. Oh, God. Yeah, this could be a very quick one again. <laughs> Chug's on fire. But then just Joe is a fireman. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, my, oh my goodness! How close was that to one of the quickest tile defences we'd have ever seen? Yeah, I really thought it was over. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Is, right, my question now is, is Joe going to get a single move in? <laughs> I'm not sure. I think he was going to go for the spear there. It didn't look like he was trying to go for the spear. Yep, he's going now for he it will. now. Now he will. Doesn't look it's like over. a move for it's Joe. It's over, Jim. Joe has not done a move. He has not thrown a punch. <laughs> Oh, Good night. <laughs> Chugs is still the champion. <laughs> wow. Well, guys, the good news is uh, if all the matches are like this, we're all getting a nice early night. We're going to feel super refreshed in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Chugs, man. Don't flip with Chugs. <laughs> <laughs> His entrance probably was longer, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know when Goldberg came back and beat Brock Lesnar? That was the match. <laughs> wow, what a what a what a strong weekend for Chugs here. Eh? Demolished Artemis on say. Sunday and then demolished John yeah. Monday. He's he's just next level, isn't he? He really is. Yeah. Yeah, Hancock is spot on. <laughs> you may not, you may not like it, but this is what the performance looks like. <laughs> wow. Oh God! Now we've got the uh, the continuing, yeah, the uh, the tag team, the tag team division in disarray after. After uh, the the appearance of Storr, actually, actually proving he's a real boy. <laughs> yeah, what what the heck is going on with the tag team division? We we had CBT, greatest champions of all time in my book. Then we had the glorious ones have a nice run. Their belts stolen from them by the Scousers, oh, hey, who won a couple of matches, and then unbelievably nobody expected it. <laughs> Blicky Flack and the real store turning up to take the titles last night. So yeah, nobody knows where they stand except for Flicky and Store. Anybody could be have the next title shot, and uh, everybody who's anybody in the tag team division is going to be scrambling for it. Yep. And uh, last week we had we had like the the uh, the other half of this match, right? We had Lemon. Who won, beating Jimmy Fan, pinning Jimmy Fantastic, and uh, Cocky there at the triple threat. So now we've got the the continuation of that triple threat. Almost as if this was the plan for Friday, but it didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, that was a really surprising, impressive win from Lemon. Uh, I probably had him down as the least favourite, just about. Not by a long way, but uh, yeah, I really thought one of the other two might pick that up. So if... Uh, if Fanfox can win tonight, then maybe that puts them first in line for the title shot. Yeah, maybe.
gone from the uh, the happiest man in the JFW to the close second happiest man in the JFW. <laughs> it's Table Leg Wanger, baby. Oh, yeah. I want to say on the winning team last night, but I honestly actually can't quite remember. <laughs> um, no, Stan Firm. Stan Firm won the uh, won the thing. Didn't Stan he? Firm got oh, the win. Hey, yeah, you? they demolished Jim. Did they did they pin Jim in the end? I honestly can't remember who was pinned. <laughs> <laughs> fair, fair. So yeah, Wanger with uh, with something to prove last night after things not going his way for his team. Yeah. And, and still, since losing the titles, even though they've moved on again since. Mm. And here's FanFox Solo. You'd rarely get to see this, but it's a great entrance. I was just thinking, <laughs> this is nice. <laughs> I have never seen this. <laughs> and his opponent, first, from London, England, weighing in at 205 pounds. The English gent. <laughs> we are seeing some style tonight. This is putting me in my shorts and t-shirt to shame. <laughs> Brilliant stuff. That is a superb entrance. Business on the agenda. <laughs> and this is a terrifying entrance. <laughs> Those gelding shears. <laughs> Let's hope that he's only got them for hair. <laughs> I think hair's the last thing he's got. I mean, I think hair, some hair would come off in them, but I. <laughs> <laughs> I think Harry is not the primary uh, recipient of those. <laughs> I, uh, I normally like to fight to the death in whatever competition I'm in, but I think put me in a ring with Moradam and I'm walking out of there and taking the count out loss. <laughs> yep. I do, PC, I do, it's true. <laughs> They are gelding shears. Uh, oh, that was uh, the ice cream. <laughs> Who you got down for this one, Jim? Need I ask? Uh, yeah, Wanger, of course. <laughs> <laughs> that's the size of scissors you need a craft table like Wangers. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm I'm always a CBT guy, so I'll go for Moradam, But I kind of want Fanfox to win to back up the lemon win from last week. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wanger is off to a flying start. Oh, Fanfox catches the leg. Down goes table leg, Wanger. <laughs> Bit of a mess in the ring still. they got to sort this out. Moradam catches Fanfox cold. Oh, nice snap suplex. Double underhook as well, I think. They're all going for each other. Moradam ducks under table leg. His size a disadvantage on this occasion. But he just powers through it. No, Moradam <laughs> catches the punch. Oh, Fanfox. Fanfox out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> that was out of nowhere. It's cleaned house. Oh my goodness, they can't decide who they're fighting. <laughs> this is just war. Mm. Talk about every man for himself. These guys are the living incarnation of it. Oh no! Moradam out and Fanfox caught and arm broken, but then he ducks under the table leg as well. He is not used to fighting wrestlers this size, Jim. No, absolutely not. Boy, howdy. This is not elimination, by the way. This is first pin wins, uh, just like the last time. So, you know, uh, we will see breakup attempts, you would hope. <laughs> <laughs> not necessarily. Yeah, we didn't get any last night, but that was because uh, Hancock did such a nice job of taking out one guy and then finishing off the other. You know, that's how you got to do it. Yeah, I mean, that is that is a normal that is a normal Sunday night for Hancock, I've, I've heard. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my word, table leg <laughs> starting to use that power and strength and size advantage. Demolishing Fanfox a little bit here. Moradam's recovering though, he's got to keep an eye out for that. Got to have the ring awareness. Oh, Oof. Fanfox with the counter. Oh, man. oh wow. 
the no sell from the slap, but he just didn't react. Oh, Moridan coming in out of nowhere. Yeah, not happy with Bam Fox. Not happy at all. It is the turnbuckle, turnbuckle power. What? Ball. No, he's just gonna. Oh, he dropped him under. Oh, him. wow! Nice. <laughs> Oh gosh, Fan Fox smashed by table leg and then smashed by Moradam. Moradam caught but oh, flips wow. off the back. Oh, so oh. incredible. Beautifully done. Moradam very happy in the ring right now. Fan Fox is nowhere oh. to be seen. Oh, oh not Sabre happy man. now. It could be over. Oh. I wasn't even sure Moradam had a hand big enough to do that. <laughs> yeah, that's a handful. Whether he got all of it, <laughs> we don't know. Yeah. Oh, 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 no. oh, that woke him up. The punch in the face woke him up. Wow. They were like in all sorts of pain here. <laughs> oh, he's there he out. goes. This could be it. It could be. Are we getting the double? No. <laughs> yeah, it could have been the double. Yeah, not, not enough done to Maradam yet. He's probably the freshest out of the three after that pummeling of table leg. <laughs> they both both worked over Fan Fox oh, before. The, the Fox's, Fox's elbow. Fox's elbow. This could do it. This really could. <laughs> it's there. Table leg has not recovered. Oh my god. Oh, he's waited too long for the pin. Didn't go for the pin, and Table oh. leg is back in. Let's start this one off again. <laughs> Every man injured now. At any point, this one could end. Oh. I'm out to try. Table leg missed. Morrid, I'm celebrating next to table leg. Disaster. Oh, God. I was not smart. <laughs> not at all. Oh, he's trying to finish him. Morrid, could tap. This could be table legs. No, he's got out. He's just too small again. Yeah, slippers out. Table leg, though, whips him into the corner, working him over on the turnbuckle. Oof. Oh. <laughs> Fan Fox finally recovered, so he will break this up. No, he missed. <laughs> Gets there in the end. Oh! Unbelievable elevation on that uh, neck breaker. Adjusted neck breaker of sorts, but a massive DDT by Table Leg. Mordam nowhere to be seen. He is the winner. No! No! Kick out from Fan Fox. Oh my goodness. Table Leg's had this one. Three or four times it looked like. Yeah. Oh, oh. Moradam! Burst <laughs> of energy! Oh, but he's just table like too big. Surely he's not going to win by girl. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a hell of a win, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Very nearly did. Got two and a half on it. Elbow to the top. Moradam's head, but he's exhausted. And oh. Fat Fox is there. And Moradam is gone. Oh, oh the, no! The sharpshooter, the worst sharpshooter sharp in wrestling. And we've seen what's happened to the crotch of Table Egg. I wouldn't blame him for tapping. <laughs> Absolutely not. He can't get out. He can't get out. Oh, man. He can definitely tap off. Oh, Fat Fox couldn't hold it. The giant legs of Table Egg Wang are too much. Yeah, all three of them. <laughs> 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 Moradam back in now, huge punch to the gut by Table Egg on Fan Fox into a backbreaker. Fan Fox in trouble, but Moradam oh, wow. takes down Table Egg. Moradam's done quite a few out of nowhere attacks in the middle of all this, hasn't he? Yeah. Oh, he's going to launch him. <laughs> wow. That is not easy to do on a man of uh, Table Egg size. Very impressive. Good leverage. Good physics from Moradam. Oh! Mm. Table leg like flying. What's the plan now? <laughs> Just punch him in the chest. That's as high as he can get. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a jump to do that. Fat Fox is back. Oh! oh Fox, Fox bottom. bottom! Fox Bottom! Oh, Fox that could bottom. be it. That really is it. That's got to be it. The dress for business double. No! Oh! <laughs> How did Maradon kick out of the Fox Bottom? <laughs> Oh my goodness! Oh, but now he could. Now he could definitely tap. He could yep. definitely go. Oh, he slipped out again. He's a slippery swine, isn't he? <laughs> he really is. Wang is just getting to his feet. I think Wang has got this. Yeah. Wang has got this. Wow! Wow! Oh, this was. This is <laughs> optimistic. And now Martin's got this. <laughs> Chaos. 
Oh, oh DDT oh. busted open. Huge. That is the end of Moradam. It is effectively... Oh! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, this is the end of Moradam. Fanfox needs to wake up. Fanfox needs to wake up, or this is he over. He can't get there! He can't get there! Fanfox can get there! Oh, no, Fanfox, Fanfox is, is up. up! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! <laughs> Just in time! Neck breaker on Fanfox, though. If he pins more damn it's done. Oh, man. Goes for the elbow. And now the pin or not? No. Oh my goodness, Moradam up. Oh! 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 Again! Again! Oh. oh man. Oh my goodness. Oh. That was completely out of it. Make the pin, Moradam. Make the pin. <laughs> no, but he's trying to submit him. But Fanfox is back. <laughs> Fanfox is back. <laughs> This is wild. This is absolute craziness. <laughs> oh, fun fun. slips the scoop slam. <laughs> Moradam blocks the punch. <laughs> Fox blocks the punch. What? Table leg completely down. Moradam in the corner. Going for a ride. Superplex, oh baby. Oh my god, oh. this could end it. This could end it right now. But one is getting up. He's up! Wang is up! <laughs> Moradam goes for a right though! That is definitely the end of him! <laughs> Table leg just in time! Oh, jab to the eyes from Fat Fox! Oof. Not enough! Not enough! Belly to back! Oh, no. oh he sweeps the leg! <laughs> Holy moly, submitting Wanger! Submitting Wanger! <laughs> Wanger could tap! Moradam is not gonna make the save! Wanger oh, somehow oh, grabbing the ankle of Fan Fox. Oh my god. Neck breaker from Fan Fox. <laughs> he is exhausted and well might he be. He's got something in store. Is it the Fox's elbow? No, he's going to launch him as well. <laughs> Both of them have done this to Wanger. <laughs> Madness. Oh. Moradam's back. He'll break this up. <laughs> Fox with the punch. What's he doing now? He's backing off. He's absolutely oh. exhausted. Oh no, Fat Fox, the little foxes. Oh. Not the little foxes. Oh. The fox comes and never to appear. <laughs> Snap suplex. Fat Fox is gone. Can Moradam finish Wanger? Oh man. Oh. No. Oh, too please, long. Please. Too long he had to recover. Holy moly, we have not had a triple threat like this in a long time. Submitting Wanger, surely this time. Surely he tapped. Oh. No! <laughs> I tell with the knees. Oh. Slips the scoop slam. Blocks <laughs> oh, the kick. <laughs> Misses this? the knee. Misses the punch. Oh my god. Rudely brings it back up. Fan Fox is back, catches the kick, and a huge heel to the head, but Wagger with the backbreaker. Moradam completely down in the corner. Can table leg finish Fan Fox? Falling fist to the head, that might be enough it after all be. this epicness. That really could now be it. Oh, it, oh no, it isn't. <laughs> it isn't. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh, what is this? Oh, what is this? I think they saw how fast the, uh, the Wemdo title match was and decided to uh, to make up for it. This is it now. If, if uh, Moradam doesn't wake oh. up, the super kick, yeah. it's all over. That's Moradam is it. not getting up. My Moradam God. is not getting up. Well done. What? 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 How is it possible? What? How is it possible? What? Is it possible? <laughs> oh. What? Oh no, Moradam, what are you doing? What are you doing? No, oh, wait, that didn't work. What is it? Oh, well done, well done, table leg. Oh <sighs> my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's just it. Oh, Mrs. Wow.
A tick in the box for the Glorious Ones in one of the all-time classic triple threat matches in JFW history. It was unbelievable, wasn't it? It was unbelievable. Indeed, yeah, Jack, but I don't know whether to think about having heels and faces and, you know, focus on that more or just keep going the way we've been going for 80 weeks. <laughs> Wow, that's unreal, isn't it? That what a match that was. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, the booing super annoying. Yeah, we'd still make everyone cheer, but like we could sell, we could sell people as heels. Like we've done a little bit. We've done the odd heel run. Um, wow. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, not like, not like, not 100% though, right? Ice cream, like, um, they're not like, they haven't been. And also like, I don't know, we could, I mean, we shouldn't talk about this in the show. Cafe, we've got to keep cafe. <laughs> we can talk about it after, <laughs> right? <laughs> Next up, <laughs> we've got, uh, yeah, the Scousers are pretty heelish, aren't they? Yeah, the disgusting Scousers. Right, we've got North and South taking on the heart and soul of the JFW, the unnatural snackers. There's nothing like keeping kayfabe like saying we need to keep kayfabe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's still real to me, <laughs> god damn it. <laughs> I mean, you have a face, Moridam. <laughs> the thing is, Cock and Moridam kind of are faces right after the, after when Wanger and Jimmy tried to sabotage them and they somehow won against all the odds. Like, that cemented. That cemented yeah. the uh, cock and ball torturer's faces, didn't it? Which is, I, they shouldn't I've, be. I've thought they've been faces since then. Yeah, and everyone <laughs> loves a little bit of dirty tactics, don't they? Like, it's not necessarily a hill thing these days. Um, mm. So, we just saw a big tick for the Glorious Ones in the tag team division, which, like you said, has been exploded from the inside out. But now, we have two more tag teams that would love to get into that title contention. Yeah, two... Lovely fan favourites, you know, look at these guys, brilliant, epic entrance, gotta love it. There is no north-south divide in the JFW, there is only friendship, companionship and teamwork, and these two epitomise it better than anybody else. Let's see if they can get it done in the ring. <laughs> If only they were better at wrestling. <laughs> if only. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, PC. Yeah. He actually asked to. He actually asked to retire. That was the thing. So uh, that is why. That is why he retired, and uh, you know, got a bit portly on his on his personal yacht. <laughs> <laughs> Never seen uh, an epic run to the titles from North and South. I would absolutely love them to take the first step here tonight. Yeah, that'd be epic, wouldn't it? I'd, I'd love to see that too. It'd surprise us all, <laughs> but uh, but it would be heartwarming. Wouldn't it just? <laughs> We're gonna beloved tag teams though, Jim. Certainly more successful in the past, but uh, but everybody loves a good snack. Yeah, don't they just? They're very much beloved, much beloved team in the JFW, the Snackers. Love to see them. Bring in the bootyos. <laughs> oh, baby. Whole boxes of bootyos into the crowd. Some delightful recipient on the end of that. Whereas, uh, I don't know if I'd trust somebody throwing me a pancake. That, that might not get eaten. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I always thought it'd be pretty disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> These have got to be the favourites for this one, Jim. Yeah, yeah. To, <laughs> as much as I, as much as I, I like Nancy and Scotty. <laughs> <laughs> They're pretty inept when it comes to, to, <laughs> to actually fighting. <laughs> and 
we, we probably don't even need to go further than that. But of course, Muppet in their corner as well. What a legend he is. Absolutely robbed last night, right? The Scousers changing the rules at the last minute. He wasn't pinned up for mid. He should have got a one on one effectively at that point with Hancock, and he didn't get it. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Ansi was pretty great when he made his debut in the JFW, but unfortunately the concussions have caught up to him. And <laughs> <laughs> now he's just was, it, was he like Santino Morella that for like the first week won the Intercontinental Championship and after that was a complete joke for five years? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> oh dear. To be fair, one of the best comedic wrestlers of all time. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I love Santino. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't not. Yeah, the Snackers off to the flying start. You'd expect, oh, big right from Ansi, though. Come on, Ansi. <laughs> it is Mike Ashley. Yes, fast. <laughs> <laughs> Danny Dyer and Mike Ashley. <laughs> <laughs> the epitome of an orphan cell fan. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Ansi slipping out of the back of Johnny Five. Oh, and Santa Whoa. flying. Go on, Ansi. <laughs> oh, Here man. comes the big man. <laughs> In a match with Satterfield, that's saying something. The yeah. only man that could out eat the snackers. <laughs> yeah, he needs a constant supply of sausage and bean melt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice right. Nice right. <sighs> Oh, don't get counted out, guys. Swift kick to the back. J5. Oof. Oh! Oh, <laughs> Descotti. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> brutal. Absolutely brutal. And he's not going to let it stop there. J5 wants to finish it in style and make a statement for them, like we said, in regards to the JFW Tag Team Championships, the two heads belts, as uh, so many tag teams want to. Yep. And here comes the little tiny feet of Satterfield. <laughs> and somehow does Scotty fighting back despite those brutal blows to the head on the ring post? Oh, couldn't quite make the tag. He desperately needed it, and he's off to the enemy corner. That is not good. <laughs> wow, quick tagging from the Snackers. Yeah. What, what you need to do, although Satterfield is the fresher man, so they probably want to bring him back in again fairly soon. Yeah. Uh, Muppet Pac-Man, Fast Apache Muppet Pac-Man is the manager of the Snackers. Well, he's not. He's the third member. Usually he's, he sits out the tag matches, to be fair. Yeah, Here comes yeah. Ansi. He managed to get the tag. North and South getting it back on track. Oh, J5. And he is not the fresh man, like I said. This could start to be a problem. Oh, the wonderful, wonderful counter clothesline. And he looks like he is looking for Satterfield. Wise, fresh man in the ring. Ansi could be in trouble. Satterfield is a machine. Oh, huge, huge suplex. Stumps. The stomps coming in like tiny steel hammers. Yeah, it's it's worse. It's more acute when it's from a bit from a small foot, right? Yeah. It, all the uh, the power and compression is placed precisely in a small area, concentrated. Yeah. Hello, Moradam as well, by the way. Oh dear. Looked like oh, he was nice. looking for a tag, but holds on too long. Ansi manages. Yeah, to break Ansi free. manages to get the elbows in. Yeah, really nice work from Ansi there. Oh! Knocks him for six. Oh, it doesn't last though. Satterfield, made of sterner stuff. Yeah. The Snackers are on a mission here. You can tell they're motivated tonight, but Ansi dodges out the way. He <laughs> is trying. He really is trying. Oh, gets him again. <laughs> oh, one too many. Went to the well one too many times, Jim. Oh, but a kick to the gut. Yeah. And He's that's where the in. snacks go. Satterfield won't like that. <laughs> it's also where all his beer goes, and he won't like that even less. <laughs> yep, yep, not good. Is it J5 time again? It is, and I fear for Ansi here, Jim. Oh, wow. 
and seen that. Isn't that crazy? Oh, wow. He, he totally didn't feel it. Turned around <laughs> and right-handed J5. Something rotten. Yeah. And here comes the Scotty again. Oh, baby. Wow. <laughs> what a move. North and South really, really trying in this one. Giving it the best we've seen from them in a long time. Yeah. The Scotty no longer worried about Newcastle United. Of course, that burden is off his back. <laughs> so maybe he's a fresh, renewed man. Yeah, maybe. Hello, Tom Schnitz. <laughs> oh, no. Huge right from J5, though. Can't quite get to Satterfield. I think that was the plan. That body of Descotti just too large. <laughs> yeah. Ah, there it is. Man, they are tagging like an absolute machine, aren't they, the Snackers? How many? I've lost track of how many tags they've made. Yep, great, great strats. Constant tags keep both guys fresh. Here's... Oh! <laughs> Tiny boot to the gut. And, uh-oh. Oh, Descotti. Uh oh Oh! Oh, man. Thunderous knee splits him open. Oh. Oh, he's no, desperately he fighting care. back. What the he's, he's unleashed the beast. He's unleashed the beast. Oh, my God. That just made him angry. Oh, oh the package ball driver. Brutal. <laughs> Can Atsy stop J5? No, he can't. No. Can he take him out now, though? No. No, he can't. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Atsy. True to form. <laughs> Satterfield out to dry. Satterfield finally fighting back. Kicks him away. Could definitely do make an attack after all of that. Scotty as well, though, been busted open in this stint in the ring. Yeah. Like Both men. Oh, oh, Cleo. Oh, wow. Out of nowhere. <laughs> Antsy, where are you? Oh, no. Oh, oh it kicks out of two. Wow. Oh, my God. No cells are kicked to the back. What is the Scotty on? I mean, what? Greg's. Greg's is the answer. Oh, look at Rana from the Scotty. Yeah. What is this? What is this? <laughs> Huge suplex. Three amigos. Unbelievable. Here we go. Ferdinand Espria and Shearer. Love to see the, it. The power of that. Mind-boggling. <laughs> and another oh package my. power driver. Oh my oh god, my this goodness. is done. This is it. J5's got to stop it. That is the only hope. That He's is the only to. hope. Ansi's in. Oh, too slow. He got lost. <laughs> got lost. Oh, but this time he's got J5. <laughs> Yeah. This time he's got J5. J5 is out of there. If, De if Descotti can finish this again soon, Jim. Mm. Oh, gets countered. Nice boot from Satterfield. Whipped into the corner. Oh, no, that devastating flying punch. What's <laughs> the slap? <laughs> <laughs> when will we see J5 again, though? Oh, man. He's stirring. He's stirring on the outside. Doesn't hold for the pin. The Scotty desperately going for the uh, the tag. It cuts him off. Saffield so. cuts him off with an armbar. Beautiful move. Scotty desperately got to get to Anthony here. Lovely elbow to the gut. Can he take advantage to get the tag? Surely not another package ball driver. It's a power no. ball, isn't it? Jackknife power ball. What the hell? Whoa! <laughs> Don't celebrate! Pin him! Pin, Pin him. him! What are you doing? J5 is still outside the ring. Oh, he's coming! He had it one! Oh, my no. God! J5 was no. still outside the ring. My God. Dodges the kick, though! Collide! <laughs> Close line! Close line again! Oh, man. Fortunately, J5 is recovered. Nothing against the stackers, but you got to love North and South. you got to <laughs> cheer for the underdog. Suplex, three amigos again. Damn. Southfield is destroyed, surely. <laughs> you could pin him for a 10 count, but you got to deal with J5. Yeah, that's the thing. He keeps pinning too close to him. Ansi doesn't really have a chance. <laughs> I mean, Ansi's oh, getting God. lost on the way, on the way to, on the way to J5. Uh, uh. <laughs> His brains are like scrambled eggs. Oh my goodness, Jim. Third. <laughs> Oh. Third package ball oh. driver. That's got to be it, Ansi. Just get in the way. Maybe. Maybe. He's done it. Yes. No. Oh, he missed. Oh, he's so close. <laughs> He's missed. Oh, my God. Ansi. He 
actually oh. beat J5, but he just missed. <laughs> 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 oh, jawbreaker from Descotty. What a tear Descotty's been on, by the way, right? Yeah, like, this has been monstrous. Oh my goodness. Dropkick to Satterfield. Poor Satterfield. No wonder Descotty needs a rest in the corner. <laughs> yeah. One out from beating him up. If Descotty could tag with, say, another Descotty, we might have a very different tag team around here, <laughs> yeah. just quietly. Oh, uh -oh. No. Uh oh, here's the knee. He's busted oh. open before. It's only going to make it worse. Ansi, it's your time to shine. Doesn't go for the pin. Interesting. Oh my goodness. Probably should have done in trouble again. Here's Ansi. Here's Ansi. Wee. <laughs> the kip up from the sky. Oh, and oh. now Ansi's ready to finish it. Oh my god. Poor Satterfield. This is horrific. <laughs> oh my goodness. The dire death drop. <laughs> Day five has saved this match so many times. He's taken him to the corner. Oh. Disguy can make the save. Disguy can make the save. I never thought I'd see it, but smart move from Ansi. <laughs> oh, Disguy no, got lost. <laughs> no. Oh, but J5 gone. <laughs> Just pin him. He's God. probably going to stay down for about half an hour. <laughs> the absolute ineptitude of North and South to stop in interference. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cheeky, cheeky move from J5, <laughs> taking it in turns. Oh, North and South, you've had this one so many times. Oh, God. oh my like God. Like the opposite of CBT, they should be really good on paper, but they just can't do it. <laughs> yeah. And there's the snap oh. mass. Oh, the Scotty surely no. Oh, just oh he hasn't been in all that much. To be fair, what a kick out! Yeah. You see, the Scotty's still recovering on the outside in no state to save him, and now it's J Five Satterfield who's taken probably the worst battering he's ever had in tag team competition history. Oh. Finally <laughs> escapes the ring. Oh wow. Great stuff from J5. He's been dying to get in the ring. Yeah, he's so fresh now. He's had such a long race. Shake, rattle, and roll. <laughs> Three. Now Descotty needs to come in. Look at this. <laughs> wow. Top rope, oh Johnny. Oh, my goodness, Jim. Oh, my goodness. Top rope, Johnny. Oh my goodness, diving headbutt, here comes to Scotty. He's fine. Oh Ref down. <laughs> Ref down. Oh, oh no, to Scotty. Oh no, how can Ansi fight him by himself like this? <laughs> Jawbreaker. Self rock bottom. Self rock bottom. <laughs> Self -rock bottom. <laughs> the <Woo>! taunts. <laughs> Proper noise. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Ansi on. Fire! <laughs> oh man! Oh no! Day five turns it around. Does Scotty stirring? But I still oh. don't think we'll see him for ages. The turnbuckle and this power bomb. Turnbuckle oh. power bomb could definitely be the end if he wants it to be. Bridging oh. pin. I think that's it, Jim. No! No! <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> Oh, this is that is great spirit from Ansi. And now J5 worn out, tags in the very battered Satterfield yeah. just quietly. Yeah, I'm not sure it was a good decision to tag Satter in. And Ansi finds a counter punch <laughs> yet just long enough to recover. Suplex! Wow! Oh! Wow. Rainbow Strong to the knee! This guy hit so fast! J5 was right there though, wasn't he? He was right he there. Was. <laughs> J5 rolling to the outside. Southfield in trouble. Finds the counter. Dare say, oh, Ansi to do with tag. Snack mass. Oh no. But J5's but out Descott of the ring. Scotty's right there. J5's there's no J5. Even even Descotty can't mess this up. Yep. No. <laughs> oh no, but here goes Descotty. 
There's no tag team partners in this tag team match. Yeah. Not, not if he gets rid of him. He's struggling a bit. He is. No, to Scott, he's okay. Satfield, <laughs> out of ideas <laughs> after this epic war, what to do with Ansi. Ansi desperately getting to the ropes to drag himself up. Counters with an elbow. He's playing possum, Jim. He was playing possum. He's got him. <laughs> There's no J5. Oh, Satfield counters. Oh, man. Satfield counters. Got oh, another, no. Got another snack mask lined up. Another snack mask. Oh, it's he counted. He counters it. Antsy. Antsy. <laughs> Can you finish him, son? Come on. J5's back. J5 is back and alert. Hit him. He's going to, he's going to finish him. He's going for it. The dire death drop. It's coming in. Yep, right in the corner as well. Come on. Come on. This has got to be Surely this time. Surely this time. No, don't go around the ref. He's no. got him. No. He's got him. him. <laughs> They've won. North and South have beat the Snackers. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Sonny of these two matches, holy moly. <laughs> oh, Jim, please let the next match be a squash. I can't take it. <laughs> Not right. Unbelievable. Yeah, to Scotty got lost again. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the J5 had been worn down too much, he just wasn't able to get there. And it was so far away, right? It was so far for him to get. It was. Oh, baby, we don't get to see this very often. <laughs> They're happy together after the match winning. Wow. Uh, the start to the run to the tag team titles quietly begins. <laughs> oh, baby. What a, what a match. What a win. Incredible stuff. Oh, boy. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I think so, Mr. Whiskey Richard. Oh, my day. Boy, howdy. Right. Well, now we've got two kind of un underperformers in the JFW, really. Both both made pretty impressive debuts and then have struggled to, to, to like, really get a win since. Uh, yeah. Fymir and Burble are top that. Yeah, Fymir in particular, yeah, really struggling for form on the main roster. Burb got a couple of good wins, but has fallen away. You're not wrong. Did well at Hamageddon. But uh, some losses since then needs to turn it back around. So, yeah, for one of these, they're headed back up. And the other one, it's the pits, unfortunately. <laughs> Rock bottom faces their future. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Way to be positive, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> one of these guys is going to be right at the bottom of the JFW after this match. <laughs> <laughs> Here he is, the most uh, Scottish Spaniard <laughs> since Sean Connery in Highlander. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's the one. Fine, He's an absolute beast backstage, but he can't get it done between the ropes, eh, Jim? Not yet. Yeah. Not yet. <laughs> yeah, we often we often see him before the before claw goes on, on air and he's often beating the crap out of Rick Reckless backstage <laughs> but um, he has failed to transfer that form to the main roster he has he has hopefully this will be that turning point but he is up against a tough one we have seen Burb produce some stunning wins yeah yeah Burb's incredible beat debut Tom at Brady. Armageddon. Yeah, he beat Tom Brady and Skurometso in a triple threat. Unbelievable. Well, yeah, Skurometso, but he beat Tom Brady. <laughs> he beat Tom Brady. The greatest Tom athlete Brady, the world baby. has ever seen in history. <laughs> <laughs> well, Skuro took a pummeling last night at Survivor Series. The first one eliminated in the title match. <laughs> iron sharpens iron Rick is obviously a soft muffin <laughs> oh dear. I mean Rick's been a dominant champion that's the craziest thing right 
That it is bizarre, isn't it? Absolutely bizarre. How I just literally can't get a win against Premier backstage. <laughs> Here is Burby is ready to go. Flapping those feathers. And uh, he's got strength and he's got the speed and agility, hasn't he, Jim? He does have everything to achieve in the JFW. Yeah. I mean, he showed it his first match. He, he took down Tom Brady. <laughs> <laughs> but the greatest th athlete of all time, yeah. Tom Brady. <laughs> he's got something, he's got an incredible moveset. But since that match, he hasn't been able to just put it together again. No. He did have that wonderful tender moment with Wolfgang, though, didn't he? Yeah? <laughs> 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 Tragically, they haven't become a tag team since. Maybe they should. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, yeah, especially with Volk failing in his world title shot, having lost the Wembley Championship. That, that might be their future, Jim. Yeah. <laughs> What? Oh, Hurricane Rana by Vermeer after one of Burb's own. Mm. Burb with the counter, though. Back and forth. Oh, my goodness. Crushingly clothesline to the outside onto the concrete. And there's that agility of Burb. Oh, God. I don't really know what happened there. <laughs> Something yeah, happened. Yeah, and I don't think they know. Both of them look hurt. <laughs> Burb the first to recover. <laughs> Vermeer bouncing up, though. Yeah. Oh. Go, for a, go for a weapon, but gets uh, cut off by Burr a bit early for that. Yep. Yep, that was not a great time to go for the weapon. <laughs> <laughs> Just about as good as Moradam's celebration time earlier. <laughs> yeah. Wow, famous. Uh, oh, look at the taunts. <laughs> uh, uh, a happy man with his start, and I, I think he's every right to be, but he gave for me too long. Recovering with the chops and punches and kicks, but he catches a kick. Back to the concrete goes from here. Taunted, taunted in his face by Burb. <laughs> oh, Beak nasty. Again. Takes, you, takes it out of you here on the outside as well. Massive right. Chops and rights. Mir collapsing on the commentary table right in front of us, Jim. Yeah, back to his, his former home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, misses with the right, though. And Vermeer catches him. Oh, attacking the beak. <laughs> yeah, smart. Beak into the turnbuckle. No bird likes that. <laughs> this is the stomp. Come on from here. That's better. Forearm. Locks him up. Ooh. Oh, headlock. Trying to finish oh. it. <laughs> nice, nice. Stunner thing. counter. Yeah, really nice. From Bub. But Vermeer catches the kick. Oh, oh no, no. Is the ref going to call it? No, it's extreme rules. It's extreme rules. Oh, my yeah. goodness. It could be over. Oh, man. <laughs> Has Vermeer found his home in extreme rules? Is that why he's so good backstage? I think he well, might no be. by the end of the match. Now he's going for a weapon. This is a better time. What have you got up that kilt, Vermeer? <laughs> he's he had a chair, chair up there all along, Jim. <laughs> oh. Burb just too quick, unfortunately. And the chair's going to sit in the ring for a little while. Knee to the gut of Burb, though. Vermeer still doing well. Oh, oh, nice. Swinging leg drop over the top rope. Certainly got strength and agility of his own, Vermeer. Absolutely. Oh. Boots into the floor and a massive knee to the beak. You're right, Jim. He's targeting that beak. <laughs> yeah. Making Burb kick out. I don't think that'll win it yet, but he's already up to two. Yeah, he thought he might have got the win there. Oh, oh he's going for it now, Jim. Oh, boy, howdy. This devastating DDT. Onto the chair. Oh. Not quite. Not quite, but that <laughs> absolutely could be it. It's for me, got his first win in between the ropes. He's he does. He's yes. For me. <laughs> Beautiful. Extreme rule specialist for Mia. <laughs> if you can let him do that, he can win matches. Yeah, brilliant stuff. Oh, man. 
Poor old Burb. The absolute dregs of the GF. <laughs> the biggest loser. <laughs> Where does he go from here? He's hit rock It has to be someone, Jim, and it doesn't mean it has to be him forever, right? <laughs> yeah. Here is your winner, Mike Myers. Oh, wow. What? Why is he called Mike Myers? He's called like Fame Myers or something. I can't remember what it was. It's not Mike Myers, it is like Fame Myers or something, or Fire okay, Myers. Fame or something. Myers. Something stupid, I can't remember what it was, but it was like maybe Five Myers or F Myers, I don't know. It was something Myers, but it was hard to make something <laughs> like Fire Me, you know? <laughs> yeah, fair, fair. <laughs> it's pretty good though, what was that? Right, oh boy, here we go. The most successful tag team of all time, the three time, I think, tag team champs. Um, das Hats taken on. Big up. <laughs> Wrestling Kick Nation. <laughs> Storm. Yeah, Turkey. here we go. The, the brand new, sparkly, shiny new tag team champions. Wrestle Kick Nation in all their glory. Das Hats, like you say, won the titles more than anybody, but not for a long, long time, Jim. That's true, yeah. yeah. Uh, their, last, their last taste of glory was a while ago. Um, and it is almost like Blood Bowl Tactics, yeah, it is almost like that. Yeah, that's true, Tom Schnitz. It's almost like I'm just going to grab some water, Jim. I will be right back. Brilliant. Yeah, that was the Blood Bowl I couldn't remember. I couldn't remember when I was doing the card, but yeah, Blood Bowl Tactics. Oriolensis is, of course, Blood Bowl Tactics. Um, in Blood Bowl, the, the game that he plays on the side when he's not summoning Germans to battle for him in, in wrestling matches. <laughs> so let's, let's go to the match. All levitating like a dirty chi and deep on Fox, yeah. And I guess you've just turned up, Fan Fox, uh, seeing who are these tag team pretenders. I guess you missed uh, the earlier matches, but it, it was an incredible performance by Fan Fox against Wanger and Moria. And here we go, Ori Lensis has summoned Lean Gary. He was probably happily eating some. Uh, some. I don't know what I was going to say. <laughs> Some curry first. <laughs> Dancing around in his later hose. And unfortunately he's been dragged off to the JFW. Oh dear. <laughs> it was probably the best triple threat match we've ever had in the JFW conference. <laughs> Not off the streets, no, uh, you know, Lean Gary has a happy life in Germany, but every Monday, <laughs> mostly every Monday, <laughs> he, is, he is teleported to the JFW in America, <laughs> wearing a weird cowboy outfit. Not really knowing how he got there, and somehow has to make his way home after the, after the fight. <laughs> oh boy. And now we've got Storr. We've seen him, he's a halfling chef. We've finally seen Storr, and now he's coming out with Flicky. We don't know how he gets home, uh, Ice Cream. Star is mocking Aurelensis. <laughs> it's dressed as a oh country my wizard. Goodness. <laughs> Flicky back in his old attire and uh, and store. Wow, <laughs> what response will we see from Aurelensis tonight? He isn't gonna like this. <laughs> oh 
I'm, uh, I'm surprised that uh, Store happy to dress as a wizard because, of course, they are only half the price <laughs> of a Halfling Master Chef. So he's lowered himself to that level. But, uh, but yeah, going to get a rise out of Ori here, no doubt. <laughs> yep, and Flicky back in his old attire. Flicky is, looks to be out of his mental <laughs> despair. <laughs> we've, got a, we've got a country wizard mirror to start us off. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Who's, who's who, Jim? I, I, can't, I can't tell what's going on. So, somebody backbreakers and chokes somebody? <laughs> Glorious. Oh, dear. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point, Star. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah, does he does say Star on the back? Yeah, oh, wow, I can't remember doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Good, good job, Jim. Early yeah. tag from Story took a little bit of damage there, and it's always good to get the tags in quickly. Flicky, the absolute beast, in to face off against Ori Lensis. At least we can tell who's who now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. Smashed into the corner by Ori. Ori's off to a great start, to be fair. He is, yeah. Oh, commentator's curse. <laughs> He was looking great, Rushing. and he got flattened. He was. Let's hope he doesn't tap here. This could be very short. <laughs> Fighting his way out. That's how, uh, how Flicky won against the Scousers, two on one. <laughs> oh, Pushing clothesline in the other corner, and now knee to the face. Working over Flicky quite nicely. Mm -hmm. Of course, it means everything to beat the champions, doesn't it, Jim? So uh, Das Hats know what a huge opportunity this is for them. Yeah, I'm sure if they get the win tonight, they'll be at the top of the pecking order. Definitely so. Definitely so. Oh, Flicky powers it around. Sends Ori over to store. Oh, but a counter elbow from Ori. Pick off the ropes. Oh, too strong. Too wow. strong, and down goes Ori. Mm -hmm. And here comes <laughs> Store Baby, and the confusion reigns once more. <laughs> I think that's Ori taking. Oh, you can tell from the names on the back of the shirt. Okay, yeah. Ori taking down Store. Store, pop it up. <laughs> Caught again by Ori. <laughs> oh dear. At least Store has ginger hair, you know. Un unlike the unlike the Discord avatars, you you can actually tell these guys apart by the hair. <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. Oh, oh Lean Gareth for the first time tonight whips Store into the ropes. Oh man, chops him in the face. That's a bit <laughs> bit harsh. <laughs> it's brutal, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, Boston Crab. It's Flicky not going to make the save. Please get out of his store. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, power's out. Power's out. Small but powerful. And here comes Flicky again. Good tagging <laughs> from Wrestle Kick Nation, but they're not getting too much else done just yet until that massive belly to belly from Flicky. All right. It's time for the champs to shine. Cranking the head of Lean Gary. He's going to wish he was back home having his dinner. <laughs> the only German cowboy that I know. <laughs> I think he's the only German cowboy ever. <laughs> <laughs> Slips off the back of Flicky. Oh my oh. goodness. Massive oh, wow. powerbomb to Flicky. That is impressive. Incredible. <laughs> Flicky too strong this time though. Throws him away. Tries to again, but this time Lean Gary with a sensible kick to the gut. Whips him towards Ori. Mm -hmm. And here comes Ori. Oh, no. Of course it was a sensible kick. He is German. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ori missed. Oh. Ori missed and he's going for a ride. Oh, my goodness. Even in the neck breakers, Flicky's got power. Mm -hmm. Crazy. Double underhook. <laughs> Duplex. Oh, Flicky has warmed up now. He is on a rampage. He really is. A little bit of context curse, maybe. Yes. <laughs> oh, we're looking at the wizard sleeve elbow <laughs> drop. 
<laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh! Oh, he's going for it! Store's in! Oh wow. Store in really quick. Yeah, great stuff from Store. And then quickly out again before Lean Carrick can get his hands on him. Oh no! Ori, though, with evil in mind. It's the 150k dream, but. Oh, he counters it! Flicky instantly. Instantly counters. Oh, gosh, oh the, the choke. choke slam! Oh! No! Press slam! Oh, wow! The Spide Buster! <laughs> wow! Wow! Three moves in one! Incredible. Somehow, Ori. Still managing to get Flick in the corner, but a huge boot and a huge <laughs> clothesline. And Ori's in all sorts of trouble. Yeah. Oh, Sends him flying. Backdrop. Spinebuster. Oh. Ori desperately trying to tag it. He's going to get to. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Lean Gary smashing down Flicky, but he doesn't feel it. But he, oh, he's going to feel it eventually. Oh, he's still going and he gets in store. Oh, Goodness me. Go. Battle of the gingers. <laughs> caught the kick. Store caught the kick. There's no, there's no worry. Oh, Lee Gary dodges out of the way and a massive clothesline. Oh, but he's sent outside by Store. Nicely done, Store. Oh, onto the concrete. Oh, Store and I'm having a great time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, Storm. What are you doing, buddy? Lean Gary out the way. Gets caught by a swinging fist, though, and a cell broke one onto the concrete. Onto the concrete. Yep, 23 feet of concrete. Brutal. Oh, he can't get Rudely. Rudely sent back into the ring by Storm. Ori has finally recovered, though, so if Lean Gary. Does find himself in too much trouble, or he might be able to make the save. No tags allowed for Lee and Gary. I don't know if Ori's that much fresher, to be fair. Yeah. This is a bad start by <laughs> Wrestle Kick Nation. It certainly isn't anymore. Goodness me, this is a long way to go. <laughs> I think he might connect, actually. I think he might connect with this one. Oh, <laughs> oh, he's caught! Into the sharpshooter! Into the sharpshooter by Lee and Gary! Can Flicky save him? Not not saving him, oh, he gets straight out! Oh, too slippery! He certainly did connect, holy moly! And here comes Flicky! Lee and Gary's still in a world of hurt! <laughs> oh! Double stupid king! <laughs> There's no nice moves from Flicky. Oh god, no there isn't. <laughs> this He's is taking worst. him to school. He is a teacher, Jim. Yeah. He's taking him to school. <laughs> yeah. And oh. like most of Flicky's pupils, I don't think he learnt anything from that. Flicky able to bounce up once more, but one too many times. Ori takes him down, but there's no lean Gary. Ori needs to keep this going. Rakes the back. No, turning him around. <laughs> oh, he's doing it again. No, he's, yeah, he's doing it again. Yeah. The elbow. The wizard sleeve elbow drop. Oh, nails him. But stalls there. He's got to break this up. Oh, he didn't. Doesn't did, make it. He didn't get that. Doesn't make time. it. Ori single handedly beating the champions. And like you said, they are now absolutely next in line for that title oh, shot. No. What a win for Das Hats. They are back in business. Oh, man. I don't believe it. Yeah, was he was he too slow or was he too short? I'm not sure he didn't get it in time, but myth. Yeah. I mean, he is short, isn't he? Yeah, halfling's are not natural sprinters. He is only movement five. I mean, he's not used to wearing this uh, this attire either, is he? Maybe that slowed him down. 
<laughs> Maybe a bit of him in his ass trying to take the mick out of Ori. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, huge win. Huge win for Das Hats. Puts them right back on the map. Incredible. It sure does. It sure does. Oh boy. And now. Now it's time for a JFW Classic. The two biggest hitters we've ever had. EAB and Crusher. A classic on paper. It could be absolutely horrific <laughs> in person. <laughs> 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 no, I, I am excited for this one. We got teased with EAB last night. It was not delivered. And now there's no getting around it. We've got extra arms, but ladies and gentlemen. Woo! Wow, his long awaited return of the Jeff W. I don't think we've even seen him since like WrestleMania. Unbelievable. Yeah. Since that when, uh, uh <laughs> when when Rick was corrupted by the forces of chaos and so was uh Bezel. Oh, yeah, no, he, he returned, didn't he? He returned and he, he, he donned the Iron Man suit, didn't he, Rick Reckless, to beat him for the uh, title of WrestleMania? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I think that was the last we've seen of EAB. And then he, obviously, Mr. Wow. Jim McMahon, you know, paid, EA, uh, paid Bezel however much it took to get EAB back in, back in the ring. <laughs> yeah. Long awaited moment here. Nah. And if he beats Crusher, sure, sure we'll see even more of him. Oh my God! I've just seen there's a there's a there's a there's a, there's a thing in the crowd. Go go go! And it's it's for Crusher, right? Without doing the go move, but also it could be for Bezel uh, because he's got full gore on his knuckles. Uh, 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 <laughs> Yeah, maybe, fan folks, maybe. <laughs> Bezel's pretty cheap. Well, there you go, you heard it here first. Still more competent than the entire staff of Cyanide and 2K, so there you go. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Lincoln, you'll miss him. Here comes Crusher, baby. <laughs> oh, my God. Now, that is a frenzy wild animal. Holy moly. It, it certainly is. It certainly is. <laughs> the, the only, well, not man, I don't even know what. The only Minotaur to match the size and strength of EAB, but he better be blitzing half the time to even do that. <laughs> you don't know what he is? He's a Minotaur. Clearly, Rick. Clearly, Rick, he's a Minotaur. <laughs> Clearly, clearly. And I'm sure he's got claw, but it does look like uh, EAB has that iron armor or whatever the heck that new terrible, terrible skill is. <laughs> iron hard skin, there you go. Funny, of course, because Crusher would have Juggernaut being the counter to stand firm, and EAB would have iron hard skin being the counter to claw, so there you go. <laughs> there we go. Oh, wow! Oh, my goodness! Russia winning the Battle of the Bulk early, but uh, EAB taking him down with a leg drag. Amazing. That ref does not want to get in the middle of this. I think he's just going to let this one go, Jim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he wouldn't want to be anywhere near these two, would you? Oh, my God. Strength of Crusher really proven he has got what it takes to match EAB for size and power so far. Yeah. Oh. Oh my goodness, Jim. Crusher might win this one. He, he may do. He's the only creature in the JFW that can that can go head to head with the EAB, I think. Already with a cheeky one count. <laughs> oh. Huge, huge boot. Hard to say. It's hard for them to portray the power going into all of this because they're evenly matched in size, but it's so much more. They are so gigantic and so powerful. <laughs> the referee looks like a child. <laughs> <laughs> yes, if, if anything is a good comparison, it is that. Oh, standing on the, uh, the guts, so to speak, metaphorically, of extra arms, but I'm sure he doesn't actually have guts. <laughs> He's got some kind of circuits and stuff, and you never know, they might get damaged by these 
tremendous yeah. blows from Crusher. They, they really could. Oh, Crusher <laughs> celebrating for too long. <laughs> EAB's back. Elbow to the head. Scoop slam. Oh, oh huge scoop slam. <laughs> Oh, but Crusher with a counter clothesline. Already back in control. And EAB sensibly been programmed well there. Smarter than the Blood Bowl 2 AI, that's for sure. Rolls to the outside. <laughs> to be honest, two penguins wrestling would be programmed better than <laughs> Blood Bowl 2 AI. <laughs> oh, there we go. There's the strength of EAB. Just catches a punch as if it's nothing. And then crushes Crusher against the mm -hmm. ring. And smashes him to the ground. Now EAB's found his form. The rust is gone. <laughs> For once, not metaphorical rust. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ring rust him. a very real thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very serious condition for wrestling robots. Yes. Uh, smashes Crusher into the uh, the uh, foreign announce booth a couple of times. And then Crusher with a sleeper hold. Oh, side rush and leg sweep. Crusher getting the better bit, best of it back in the ring again. But he's he's loving to celebrate maybe a little bit too much here. Yeah. Dave, EAB too long to recover. Oh. oh. Punch to the heart. Oh my God. And then just dropping his weight on Crusher. I mean, that destroys normal, normally built humans, but Crusher is just as big as EAB, just as heavy what? as EAB. Well, well, that's it. Yeah, for all their extra power going into the moves, they've got extra toughness as well. So, yeah, wonderfully even match up this. Crusher with the third pin attempt of the night. EAB, none of his own so far, but has kicked out at one every time. Pummeling the metal face. Oil, oh. oil leaking from EAB, Jim. Yeah, I saw that too. <laughs> Unbelievable. As time goes on, that's going to, you know, wear EAB down, isn't it? Oh, oh there's spear. The spear. Spear. Is he going to pin? No. He's not going for it. Carries on the beating very successfully, I might add. Oh, Exhausted now, though. Crusher spent all his reserves. Done amazingly well so far. This oh, could be boy. it. Here we go. What a win by Crusher if this is over. Jackknife powerbomb. Surely he can't get him up. No. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. He's done it. It's over. He's done it. Won. Wow. He's done it. Russia is back and he's bad. The most dominant win over EAB we have ever, ever seen. Wow. Wow. No one's ever done this. Nope. Not one. Not one. Wow. Wow. Really, really hammered home the superiority from Stan Firm. Theresa Mim has got to be loving this. Stand firm, yeah. won, at, won at Survivor Series, and this, you know, obviously EAB, we expected to be the, the main the main thing, like, you know, stopping Stand firm winning, right? And then they got yep. this match, and just Crusher crushed. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. I can't believe what I've just seen. <laughs> Absolutely incredible. Well, there we go, Jim. I honestly can't wait to see Crusher again. I hope he sticks around. And uh, you never know with a Minotaur, though. But uh, it would be amazing to see what he can do against the other top JFW superstars. <laughs> Absolutely. I know you're a big fan of Minotaurs, Rick. <laughs> I am. I am. It's true. <laughs> right. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much, Rick, for the commentary. As always, absolutely glorious. Thanks for the raid as well. Brilliant stuff. Thanks everyone for watching. Glorious. Thank you so much. Woo! Woo! <laughs> and uh, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic. <laughs>